Hey, we're your EHS Broadcasting. We live stream sporting events, produce the video you are watching right now, and run the Tigertron. If you are interested in video production, camera operation, sports announcing, or learning how to run a YouTube channel, talk to Mr. Antrim at A224 to get more information. We will teach you everything you need to know. No experience is necessary. Good morning, EHS. I'm Laura Guswell. And I'm Margaret Stacy. And welcome to your Friday morning video announcements. Tiger Den is open. Students must have IDs and a pass if you're going during class. Get ready to groove at the Edwardsville Homecoming. Disco Fever will catch on the week of September 25th, ending with the Homecoming Dance on September 30th. If you are bringing an outside guest, you must have a guest form filled out and signed by an administrator and brought to either Ms. Cooper in the office or Ms. Gray in A229 directly if purchasing tickets online for an online access code or bring it with you when you purchase your ticket. Access codes will be available starting September 5th. Anyone who missed the Edwardsville Peer Influence Club meeting Thursday, August 31st and would like to be a part of this group, please stop by C110 to sign up with Mrs. Sanders. Are you a choir, orchestra, or band student interested in a music-based honor society? The Tri-M Music Honor Society is now accepting applications for the 2023-2024 school year. There's a QR code with the application form on the Tri-M board in the B hallway. Applications are due today. Join the Asian Cultural Club on Fridays after school in A313. ACC strives to host a welcoming community for all students regardless of identity while also bringing emphasis to authentic Asian traditions. The first meeting will be today. Please see Mr. Mueller or Ivy Lin for additional information or questions. Boys Basketball Open Gym will begin on Tuesday, September 5th from 2 to 4 p.m. Any players not playing a fall sport that want to play basketball this winter are welcome to attend. You must have an up-to-date physical on file in the athletic office. See Mr. Battis for more information. The Math Tutor Lab will open on Tuesday, September 5th from 2 to 3 p.m. in room A309. Students should bring their math test, e-text, notes, worksheets, etc. and their student device. EHS math teachers and members from our Math Honor Society, Mu Alpha, will be in A309 every Tuesday and Thursday from 2 to 3 p.m. to help. Students must wear their school ID in their Math Tutor Lab. See your math teacher for more information. If you are interested in being a peer-to-peer -peer tutor, please stop by Ms. Burian's room in A336 to get signed up. An informational meeting for new tutors will be held on Friday, September 8th after school in A320. For any wrestlers who are not in a preseason sport, you will need to start preseason workouts Tuesday, September 5th at the John Davis Wrestling Center. You will need to have an up-to-date physical. Bring wrestling and running shoes. If you have any questions, stop by Coach Prado's room. Do you like making new friends and volunteering in your community? Do you want to help create an inclusive environment regardless of abilities? Join Key Club and Thirst Project. Key Club provides tons of volunteer opportunities and fun service projects. Thirst Project raises money to build wells in Africa. Key Club and Thirst Project will be hosting an informational meeting this Thursday, September 7th, in the courtyard outside the lunchroom. Everyone is welcome. Can't wait to see you there. Science Olympiad will be holding an informational meeting on Friday, September 8th, after school in room A340. This is an opportunity to learn more about the team and our competition. Science Olympiad is a team-based science competition with events in science, technology, and engineering. Please see Mr. Allen in room A340 if you want to be a part of the team or want more information. How do you want your name to appear throughout the 2023-2024 school yearbook? Do you want your birth name, nickname, or chosen name? Whichever you choose, that is how your name will be displayed throughout the yearbook. If you want to use your nickname or chosen name, you must complete the name change form and put it in the yearbook box in the main office. Name change forms can be found on the spinny thing in the main office. Remember, if you don't submit a form, your formal name will be used throughout the book. The deadline to submit that form is Friday, September 8th. Please note, however, that name changes are subject to approval by EHS administration. That's all for today. Have, Have a great day, day Tigers! tigers.